Fulton County residents living south of the Choctahatchee Bay are trying to cope with what they've lost to this week's heavy rains and flooding. I'd say two to three throughout the board, you know, deeper in some spots, but that's about right. Brian DeVore's Blue Mountain Beach yard and home suffered extensive flooding Wednesday with four feet of water outside his home. The only way he could reach it was by kayak. He spent the past 24 hours trying to salvage anything he can. For, for how our standing water is, because we've had some issues since last summer, it's never been this high. Uh, it's never gotten in the house uh, before for us, so that's, that's kind of new. A little farther down 30A, Ray Penna's home was destroyed. Petta says it happened in a flash. Washed the side of the driveway out. The driveway collapsed. My car, my navigator fell into the hole. Then on the other side of the driveway, the garage collapsed. It just all happened extremely quickly. And hundreds of South Walton homeowners are dealing with flood damages. Parts of 30A are still closed due to cave-ins. Just kind of get through it and, you know, it's out of our control. County crews are surveying the flooding to determine which areas will benefit from pumping and then doing the work. In Walton County, Christina Peffer, News Channel 7.